so this is a video um, overlook to show a tutorial how that I created from this image that I got from a client I created this tile so uh, seamless you know uh, tile 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 so I'll go over the steps the first step what I did I took the image and I stretch it out and I try to align the lines with um, some guiding lines that I dragged um, from the rulers uh, just like that so that was the first step after that I took the lasso tool and with the lasso tool I cut it out each tile so you can see each one of them is separate to a, a different layer and some of them was pretty um, pretty uh, full like this one and this one was pretty one piece then what I did um, I went online and I got this <coughs> this texture from cgtexture.com I will put a link on the description and you can download it as well and uh, after that what I did I just took each one of them and I aligned them to one of those hectagons so for example this one was pretty simple because it just was aligning so I dragged the tile this tile and I dragged this tile to those hectagons and I aligned it then the same for this one now this one had some discoloration so what I did I copy half and I with a mask I made it look like it's a whole tile so that's how I did this one the next one is this one what I did I cut it to six because I didn't have too much in the original picture I just took a triangle like a pizza slice from here and I duplicate it six times so you can see one two three four five six so that was that and the next one was this one was the same idea um, I could have done the because of its texture I didn't bother making it more round you won't realize that in the big picture and this one it was the same because I didn't have too much information I just had those circles so I tried to create whatever I could with a few layers together I got all those six hectagons and what I did I put them in a group and I duplicate them to match all of those hectagons so you see it create a tile now it comes it uh, returns returns but you can you know go inside and change it however you want then I I cropped it by the middle of the stars if you see I put them all in the middle of the stars and I crop them exactly so I got this tile I added some <coughs> I added the same texture that I had original just on soft light mode so it gives the full picture gives it more realistic and then I color corrected and I got this after that what I did I wanted a bump map so because you see how you see how I got this bump small bump for the tiles gives a good feel like it's a little bit bump bumpy so what I did I took the original picture and I did a black and white and I added blur mask and then I got 
nice and blurry because I didn't want all the grain. So I added a blur mask and I got this nice. So then I used it in a, a 3D rendering, one of my 3D renderings, and you can see the result. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Thanks.